Today, we're gonna do a quick glute workout with a household step stool. Stick around. Welcome back, ladies. My name is Tabitha. I'm here to help all you busy ladies juggling jobs, careers, kiddos with no real time to exercise. I'm gonna give you exercise tips, tricks, routines, and even product reviews to help make fitness a part of your life. And today, we're gonna do a workout with a household step stool. Yes, these simple foldable step stools that you can find in the household section of Walmart, Target, I think you can find them at Ross and Marshalls even, but these are about five bucks, 10 bucks. They're great for us. We have them around the house for the boys, for everything, reaching the toilet, reaching things in their room. So they're really handy, but they're even more handy to exercise with. And it's so small and so cheap. So go ahead and grab your mat, grab your step stool. You can grab some weights if you'd like. I am going to not use weights in this video, but you are welcome to grab weights. If you are pregnant or postpartum, you can absolutely do this workout. I will show you the high intensity moves both on the stool and on the floor. So you have a variety of options because I know this stool is very small at the top. So some of you might feel a little, a little hesitant to jump on or off this stool. But don't worry, I will show you that move on the ground as well. That way you can build your confidence and then eventually you can jump up on this stool. So let's get started. We are going to do a quick warm up. So put that stool aside. Let's squat down nice and deep. Squat, good job, nice and deep, good. Good, getting those blood, getting the blood into those muscles. Good, let's hold it, let's go side lunge. Ah, stretching those glutes, getting them warmed up. Really push that booty back so you feel the stretch in the glute. When you feel the stretch in the glute, then that means that's a good thing. Then your muscle's gonna have to work even harder to pull it back up. Very good. Let's touch the floor. Ah, and up, down, up, good, let's keep going. Ah, stretching those hamstrings, very good, and up, good, let's bring those knees up to your chest, good. Good, rotate the knees out. Very good. Get those hips ready to go. All right, let's shake it out. Grab that stool, grab that mat. Let's get started. Okay, the first exercise we're gonna do is a lunge with a knee raise. So put your foot right on that stool. I have about a seven and a half size foot. So my heel sticks off and my toes stick off a little bit. That's okay. Just make sure you got the most of your toes and the most of your heel on there. I'm going the small way. You can absolutely spin the stool around and go the long way on the stool. I just like the small way. All right, so let's lunge nice and controlled. Deep lunge down, knee over the ankle and knee up, 10 on each side. And two, three, Good, don't push off the back toe. I want you to drive up through your foot that's on the stool. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and switching sides. Good, nice and deep so that you get a gl good glute work and down and up. Knee as much over that ankle as possible. As long as you don't let that knee go over your toe, you are fine. And five, six, seven, eight, nine, one more, and 10, good. We are gonna side lunge on this stool so quickly Quickly, the side lunge before going on the school stool. It's like you're doing skaters, so hopping from foot to foot. If you're afraid to do it on your stool, go ahead and do skaters and go, and don't stop. 
For those of you on the stool, let's go. Foot placed in the middle. Hop one, two, good. Let's keep on going. Do what you can. I'm gonna go for 10 on each side. That was three, four, good. Five, six, good. Seven, eight, nine, one more, and good. Shake it out. We're gonna go back up to the lunges with the knee up. And as you can see, I'm breathing hard already from a stool. All right, deep lunge, let's go. Push it back and lift. Good, two, three, four, five, six, good. Deep, seven, eight, nine, one more, and 10. Switch legs. So this is my second time recording this workout and up one. I had a baby buns in my last video, and then I worked glutes yesterday. So four, my booty is hurting, and that's six, Whew. seven, eight, nine, one more, and up. Good, side lunges on the ground for those of you that aren't using the stool, my stool users. Let's go, 10 on each side, and over. One, two, three, good. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Very good. Now we're gonna keep this side lunge position and we are going to side lunge over this box. Okay, okay we're to side squat on the stool now, lifting up onto the stool with each squat. So we're gonna go nice and deep, again pushing through the foot on the stool and lifting, good. 10 on each leg, that was two, three, Good, don't push off the toe, four, and five. You should feel it a little bit in the side of your glute. Six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Switch sides. Good, type of a, a side, kind of a squat, and up, two, three, four, Five, good, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Very good. Now we're gonna do in and out squat jumps. So without the box, you're gonna squat in, squat together, squat out, excuse me, squat out, squat out, squat together, squat out. Now with the box here, Let's go. 10 times out and in, out and in. Out and one and two, three, good. Four, five, six, good. Seven, eight, nine, and 10. Whew. Okay, flip it around. Side lunges again. Let's go. Squat. Up one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, good, nine, and 10. Switch legs. Nice and controlled, and down, up, one, two, three, 
three, four, five, yes honey, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good, turn that stool in and out, squat jumps. Whew. You can hear cartoons in the background. It's my little buns streaker. Okay, here we go. Out and in. Good. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one more. 10, very good. Back on down. Now we're gonna head to the floor for some bridges. My mat moves on me as I jump. Here we go. To the ground, we're going to put our heels right on the corner of the box. Okay. All right, when we drive up, Pushing through our heels, squeezing those glutes. And up, squeeze, down. Up, squeeze, down. Three, that's three, blah, blah, blah. Four, I'm telling you right now, five. My glutes are in serious pain. Six, this is the love I have right now. Seven, eight, nine one more and hold it up lift your right leg up let's go for five and one two squeeze three squeeze four one more squeeze five good switch legs and up for one two three good four one more, five, very good. Roll over to your side if you're newly postpartum and lift up that way, very good. We are going to do plyo lunges on the box. So without the box, I want you here, plyo lunges, or you can do step, quickly step back lunge. Keep on going. For ladies with the box, we are going to step up 10 on each leg with a little pop at the top, okay? We're gonna stay all on one leg and we'll switch all to the other leg. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Very good. Other leg. Rather than switching feet, for those of you that might be too afraid to switch feet, this is the easiest route to go. And let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, good, nine, ten. Back on down. So I will link in the cards below, I mean above, I will link in the cards above my post glute workout for doms and how you cure yourself from that serious glute pain that I'm experiencing right now, which I won't be this afternoon. Let's go, 10 up, one, squeeze at the top, two, and up, three, up, four, five, six, Seven, eight, squeeze, nine, one more. And let's put that right leg in the air and down. One, two, three, four, five, and switch. And up, one, two, three, four, and five, very good. Back on up, roll to the side for postpartum or pregnant women and push up that way. Good. Yes, this workout is totally fine if you're pregnant or postpartum again. Okay, I am gonna 
alternate my plyo lunges. That way, in case you want to alternate, you can do the same. But in my experience, most people have a harder time with this. So if you're coordinated, do this. I like this route better. All right. So here we go. Ten on each leg. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten more. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And that is a wrap, my friends. Again, my heart is beating. I am sweating. Hold on. I don't know if you can see the sweat on my face, but seriously, because I worked my glutes really hard yesterday, my butt cheeks are screaming at me. Now if, yes honey, now if you experience serious glute pain or DOMS, delayed onset muscle soreness after a heavy duty workout, especially legs, go to this card right here. It explains the science behind what you need to do to cure yourself. So the reason I said that I'll probably be fine this afternoon is because reworking those glute or leg muscles again, uh, not as hard, but nice and light, like how I did body weight right here, what it does is it really kind of massages that muscle again, gets it working, gets blood and fluids pumping back into the muscles so you heal faster. I did everything else last night, but this still tender. So, there you have it, ladies. I am going to quiet now and go about my day. A nice step stool workout, super easy. Get one of these while you're out shopping if you don't have one already. But as always, stay positive, work hard, and God bless. Mahalo for joining me. Aloha.